when you talk about television stations in America, 30, 40, 50 years is, is a long time, but 70 years is a legacy. That is the message from KFES Vice President and General Manager Chris Conroy as our station celebrates 70 years on the air. KFES first started broadcasting October 3rd, 1954. Yes, and although times has changed, and as you'll soon see, hairstyles. Oh, yeah. The legacy of the station has not. Nikki Clark looks back on 70 years of KFES. It all started with a vision from this man, Oscar Hirsch. This young engineer brought radio to Cape Girardeau in the 20s, but saw the future in television. Oscar was an engineer by trade an engineer by passion, and I would do anything in the world to bring Oscar through our current television station. It would blow his mind what technology has done. After getting a license from the FCC, KFES was born. I worked for Mr. Hirsch, so uh, I worked for the guy who started it all. And looking back on that, that was, uh, that was a great privilege to do that. Randy Ray remembers those early days and Hirsch's persistence to stand out. Back in those days, evening news was all the rage, but Hirsch was cooking up the breakfast show. He was a man in charge. He was the man. Mr. Hirsch was a man who wore a suit to work, but you might see him with grease on his arms because he had been at the transmitter. But in this business, change comes fast. By the mid-60s, KFES reached the televisions of two million people in parts of six states. Everything was a challenge in those days to be able to actually have uh, video and sound uh, was a big deal. When I started, there were no computers, three channels, no VCRs, no uh, social media. Paul Keener and Ray worked alongside other KFES greats like Bob Reeves, Mike Shane, Don McNeely, Jim Burns, and Mary Ann Maloney. Viewers turned to the KFES news team in the best of times and the worst. And behind the scenes, these trailblazers were a family. I can't believe I'm getting paid for this because I'm having a lot of fun. We had, we had a good time and uh, it was a family atmosphere. Together, they laid the foundation for the next generation of KFES journalists. My favorite part of what I do is the people that I work with. This is a television station that for the past 70 years is full of people who cannot wait to wake up in the morning and get to work. And as technology continued to evolve, new talent followed in their footsteps. I remember meeting Mike Shane and Marianne Maloney for the very first time and I was so nervous. And I remember walking in the newsroom and I thinking to myself, wow, they are so important and they are so short. I had interviewed a couple places when KFES came calling, but when I came to Cape Girardeau to visit the station, I was really impressed because the people here from top to bottom had been here for a long, long time. Viewers started to welcome new faces into their living rooms like Kathy Sweeney and Jeff Cunningham. Sweeney celebrated her 30th anniversary with KFVS earlier this year, and Cunningham is still going strong at 21 years. Brian Allworth, who is still here, I tell him all the time, don't leave, don't leave, because then I'll be the person who's been here the longest. And even in all of that time, the legacy of KFVS has never wavered. There's a pride in working at KFVS. You know, there's a pride in being a part of the community, a legacy station that people have grown up watching, and I think that's something that's really cool to be a part of all these years. It's neat that the idea that people invite us into their homes every night, uh, they trust us to, to deliver information to them that affects their lives, affects the decisions that they're going to make. Um, it's something that we take really seriously and it's uh, it's uh, something that we take a lot of pride in. It's the kind of station you come to and you stay. A legacy that 70 years later Oscar Hirsch would be proud of. I hope that folks sense how much we care about them and how much we care about this area. KFES really is just a special place to work. There's just a lot of great people that work here both on air and off air and uh, I'm just really proud of what we've been able to do uh, at this station. If you are a part of KFES, whether you're a viewer or you work here or you've heard about us, you are part of this legacy. You are part of the 70 year legacy. Every one of the viewers, every one of the people who work here, every one of the people in the community who come to us when they need help, you are part of this legacy. And I wanna say I'm proud to be on that trip with you. 
Love the 70 years of legacy, the 30 years of silly hairstyles. I'm, I'm trying just, to decide which one of those was my favorite. Wow, you know, <laughs> kudos Bikini to Nikki for finding my absolute <coughs> worst <laughs> hairstyle and, and making it into the retrospective. Well, hey, know. thanks to all of our it, viewers. It, no, it because, was wonderful. Uh, what, what you've a been tribute. putting up with for a long time. We really appreciate it. And, you know, you've been here. You're, you're catching up to us. How long have you been well, here? Well, yeah, I've been here 11 years now. Almost. 11 almost. years. But Todd's been here 20. 20. Right? I mean, it's true. You, you, you. You're here, and next thing you know, you're raising your family, right. your kids, in my case, grandkids. And now your kids yeah. go off to college locally, so you're not going to leave now. College, <laughs> high school. Well, when I, we yeah. transplanted here, too, the viewers have always been so nice to I know, me and, and, so and we have, really appreciate have it. watched us raise our families as we've watched you folks really raise your families. And with social media, we're all kind of connected, and we've been through our ups and our downs. And something that I've realized now is we have people working here that say they oh, grew up watching they, us. Oh, if yeah, you, yeah. And the even number, me, and I've only been here The number of yeah. kids in our newsroom who that say, I watched us. you, I've, I've, I've that, grew that up that watching good, you. I think. It I does, like it, it, it's, really, it's really nice. Well, it was it's nice really to nice. see uh, Randy in that story too and some of the old faces. Great.